Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Elite Chia, and for today's video, I will be doing a get to know me while I get ready. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. I got my eyebrows off camera because um, I just wanted to get that out the way. While I was doing that, I looked up some questions because I was having a hard time like thinking of questions about me so i decided to go on pinterest and look at a few questions and so i'm just gonna do like a run through of a few questions so um it says zodiac sign is a taurus i am a taurus i was born may 3rd so who's my best friend my best friend is my sister my twin sister is my best friend you guys um we have such a nice relationship to the point where like she trusts everything like literally everything um i know everything of her she knows everything of me and we're best friends so um besides that um my mom is my other best friend she knows i i mean my sister knows more about me than my mom but you know both of them are my best friends and my husband so three best friends <laughs> okay so says um my best first date the first date was with my husband um and we went <laughs> we went to a movie third we went to see um i think it was uh called baby i don't know if you guys remember when this movie came out in 2017 um and the movie was called baby it's about um pretty much it was like this group like i don't remember i know it was like a racing car like this dude would drive this red car and um but yeah that was our first date it was really cute because i was wearing a black um cute um blouse and he was wearing a black t-shirt and I was wearing blue jeans. And he was also wearing blue jeans. And black shoes. I was wearing my black booty. And he was wearing black shoes. And so we were matching on our photo, our first date. Can you believe that? <laughs> okay. So that was our cute first date. And then. Next question. So it says. Um, how tall am I? I am. Dee 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 dee. I am 4'9", you guys. I am really short. And a lot of people... During high school, a lot of people would tell me, Oh my gosh, you're so short. Like, yeah, I know. I'm short. And one time, there was this one girl that said, Did you know that you are classified as a midget? And I was like... I kind of just looked at her and just... That kind of, kind of like... It pissed me off and so I was like did you know that you're classified as a and I was mad I was I I don't know how that came out of my mouth because I I'm normally not that kind of person that I will not say any bad words or like I will not be mean to you even if you are but it, get, it got to the point where I got really annoyed because like I know like I am short and a lot of people are like did you know like you know like like just shut up you know so yeah i get that a lot of, i'm sure and my husband is pretty tall he's six five then is mm, what do i miss what do i miss um i miss my mom my mom lives in honduras and um it's been a few years since i haven't gone to visit her not that i can't i I can go visit her by the way if you want to know what I use I will be leaving all the, um, my products in the description so yeah so I have not been to Honduras for over nine years and it's just I'm scared um, I lived in Honduras for four years I will do another video about you know what happened to me in Honduras how traumatic it was um but um i haven't been back and i do miss my mom and i do plan on going soon um i want to go soon um but 
I've been, you know, my passport is expired and I have not been to renew it. Like, I haven't gone to renew it for literally over nine years now. <laughs> and that has been my excuse to not go to Honduras. Um, but I will talk about this in another video. So, yeah. Anywho, um, I miss my mom. I miss being around her, but I do talk to her every day. Um, um, and so, I miss her. I do miss my dad. My parents are separated, by the way. Um, but we don't have a great relationship, so I do miss him. I do. But, oh my god, it's too much. Um, but I miss more my mom and my brother, my baby brother. So, yeah, there's favorite color. Okay, so favorite color. I don't have one specifically favorite color. I actually have three favorite colors. So my first favorite color would be pink. Is that a color? So it's not baby pink, but it's like this, um, it's fuchsia pink. I think it's fuchsia pink. No, I don't know, but it's kind of like base color pink. <laughs> not me not knowing my colors. Oh my gosh, how embarrassing. Um, and then I like, uh, like turquoise blue. I like turquoise. Um, my other color is um, just blue. Blue in general. I like blue. Um, yeah, so those three are my favorite colors. And um, what else? Your favorite place. My favorite place. Um, uh, I don't have one, I think. Oh, yeah, I actually do have a favorite place. So when we would live in Florida, I would love to go to the beach all the time. We were like 40 minutes away from the beach. So we would go pretty often. And I would just, you know, go. I would go and we would, I would just sit there and watch the waves while my husband was fishing and that was my favorite place you guys like i would love i loved going to the beach this question is favorite food favorite food i have a lot of favorite foods honestly i don't have like on top of my head like this is my favorite food but i will say i love potatoes i love fried like french fries i love smashed potatoes mashed potatoes i love um anything potatoes i love potatoes i can literally eat them all day like every day um and um yeah i think that's my favorite food potatoes <laughs> but if you ask me like um yeah i think i would probably say like Honduran food i love mexican food as well like i love their tacos tamales um i love the tortas I love chilaquiles, everything. I like a lot of Mexican food. So, um, yeah, I don't have a favorite, like, specific favorite food, but, you know. Um, what else? What else? What else? Question. Shoe size. Um, I am between a six and a half, seven, seven and a half. So, it just depends on the shoe, honestly. Like, I can fit into, like, a six and a half. Um, but I can also fit into a seven and a half, and so it just depends on like this need the shoe. Says what I um eye color. So my color is it's um brown. Oops. Um. So hair color. As you guys can see, my well, you guys can't really see it, but my. Um, hair color natural hair color is actually brown but I dyed my hair I dyed my hair black at some point and then I dyed it um, I did highlights and then I did um, I think I did red at some point so currently I have it's kind of like brown with highlights um, but I'm planning on going back to black someone I love I love God, my family, and my husband. Um, yeah, 
Yeah, those are the three people I love. So, but I love everybody. <laughs> so, my current relationship status: I'm married. As I said before, I am married. Um, I we've been married for it's gonna be six years in March. Actually, 2017. We got married in 2018 of March. 23rd March 23rd 2018 that's when we got married five years of married and it's gonna be six years of us being together like boyfriend and girlfriend my relationship with my parents so my relationship with my parents it's good um especially my mom I mean not with my dad I don't have a great relationship with my dad like I don't talk to him ever um ever since my parents got separated um apparently for him i'm like a tough kid to talk to and i'm a troublemaker i guess that's what he said um and so he says that i look a lot like my mom so he doesn't like me because of that i guess i don't know but we do not have a great relationship with him only with my mom so yeah that's how it is but yeah with my mom she's my best friend like i said before we talk every single day and if there's a day that we do not talk we're kind of i get worried you know so um yeah i love my mom so much you guys um my favorite holiday is christmas christmas is my favorite holiday you guys i don't know i just feel like it brings um like the family together um last book i read i'm not gonna lie to you i hate reading i hate reading and so i don't read any books i don't have any current books that i have read and i think my last book i read was in high school yep i hate reading you guys i just i don't know like i just I remember during high school I would start a book and then like I would just read the end and I would just put like the beginning and the like the end together <laughs> and then I would just say like yep I'm done I just hated reading so much and yeah hey guys so my camera died on my camera my battery died and I literally had to wait a few you know moments for it to charge so I went in and did my eyeshadow and mascara off camera and um, I filled in my lashes again not my lashes oh my god my eyebrows again and now all I have to do is do my lips so let's do that um so where did we left off um was how long does it take me to get ready in the morning so like i was saying i don't always get ready but normally it takes me about um if i do like just like mascara and like fill in my, my eyebrows less than five minutes literally in two three minutes i'm done but if i'm doing like a full glam like today and sometimes i like to do my eyeliner like I love eyeliner and I'll do like a full beat like I a full coverage you know like that will take me about 30 to 40 minutes um so it does depends on the occasion I guess you could say next question is um if I was drunk and can't stand who's taking care of me my husband he's the only one. do I like my music loud or at a reasonable level I think reasonable level I don't like loud music I hate it because if you put it like too loud like you just don't know what like you just don't like you can't really listen unless you know the song and you're like singing to you know or you have the lyrics in hand and stuff but I do not like listening to loud music so yeah why didn't I start YouTube before I don't know honestly you guys um my camera's gonna about to die again i don't know why i didn't start youtube like before 
it has always been my dream to be like a youtuber um and I just always I was always really shy or just I would always overthink things and say to myself like I don't want this person to know like this person that I don't like or that person doesn't like me so I don't want them to know about my life you know so that was my um my camera sign again so that is one of the reasons why you guys I was always so scared of starting my YouTube channel just simply because I I don't know I just didn't want anybody you know to know like about me like I did um, move from my hometown which was Indiana Plymouth Indiana and there was just so many people that would judge me that would talk about me so I really wanted to start a new life and and get out of there honestly like it was very toxic for my mental health and all that so I had to leave and and like started my social media journey was a whole different world for me and I didn't have anybody to follow to look up to I mean I would see a few influencers like hey like do this do that but I didn't have like anybody to say like hey like do this or like this will help you you know I would just look up YouTube channels like I would go to YouTube and look at videos and just you know like just learn from there and when I did start which was about it's gonna be two years in April I believe and but I didn't start YouTube until like I think it was like a few months later after that but I don't remember to be exact so um and I had a lot I did get a lot of support from people but um I wasn't you know from people that I did expect to support me I wasn't getting it from and you get to learn who supports you and who doesn't and that's what I was scared like to see who would support me and who wasn't and who still isn't I'm still pretty new to this and so you get to see who's there for you and who isn't and it's just a roller coaster of emotions like you see like oh like why isn't this person like supporting me like why you know and it's not always gonna be like you know cute and yeah it's reason why I didn't start my YouTube channel or you know it was just because I was scared I was scared of what people would say about me um but I'm happy where I am now I am I do work with um a few brands and I um slowly getting into this world you know little by little um and it has been a big blessing so um I can't wait to see what God has in store for me in the future um and yeah I'm so excited and um I think this is all for today's video you guys I can't think of any more questions off the top of my head but um yeah i'm excited for this video so you guys can get to know me a little bit better and who am i and what i like and you know what do i like so i hope you guys enjoyed this video so i'll see you in my next video bye